Um, <laughs> Tyler Perry was on a uh, talk show. Yeah. And they got in a conversation about single black women. So you already know right there, he going to get eaten alive by women and men. The women, the men are going to eat him alive because they're going to say he's my dear. And he shouldn't be saying nothing to represent men at all. Go ahead. And, um, you know, they always I'm saying a whole nother side of this, but go ahead. But saying that he's not um, um, straight and all these oh, okay. men. Hints about that. And then women are going to get on him because, again, they're going to say he's not a man. He's not a woman. Why is a, why is a man always telling women about stuff? But I and think there's a lot of men out there who do know makeup and do know styles better than we do. But I so think, why has to be a male female thing, right? But I think um, he was asked a question and he answered mm-hmm. it. So it says here, producer and actor Tyler Perry was rubbed some has rubbed some black women the wrong way. I mean, it was everybody was going crazy over this. Oh. All over it's Twitter, black serious. Twitter. Well, now X is not Twitter anymore. Black X and um, Instagram and Facebook and everything. Okay, um, he's rubbed some black women the wrong way because of comments he made in a recent interview. The 54 year old shared his thoughts about splitting bills on Keep It Positive, Sweetie. Mm-hmm. I guess that's the name of the show. A lot of women. This is him, especially black women. You know, maybe I should I find what he said. Oh, and verbatim. It's not yeah. in that article. It is, but don't it sound better when you hear from and him? And he did start out with saying a lot of women, mm-hmm. especially black women. So he didn't just say black women need to, all black women are this. He said a lot of women, especially black women. So if that's partly what he started out his comment with, I don't see a problem. Let but, me see but go if, ahead if you can him. find exactly what he says. Let me see. You have to go into that interview then, right? They did it on The Breakfast Club, but I was oh, trying to... Oh, did they? Why don't you go to The um, Breakfast Club Tyler again? Perry goes viral for telling black women they have unrealistic standards. Let's see who this is. Experience mouthwatering He's bliss starting at only three ninety nine. Commercials. Yeah, oh, that's how they're doing it now. Commercials got to do social media. Let me see. Okay, yeah. Let's see who this is. Part than yeah. black men, right? There are a lot of black men who are successful, but for the most part, black women are making the money. So you, if you can find love, if that man works, you know, at whatever job, mm-hmm. and is a good man and is good to you mm-hmm. and honors and honors the house and honors his wife and does what he can, mm-hmm. because his his gift may not be your gift exactly that is okay mm-hmm. that's not somebody who's beneath you yeah that's somebody who came to love you at your work mm-hmm, mm-hmm. right yeah and as long as he's secure in himself to mm-hmm. know that yep she makes most of the money all i can pay is the light bill as long as she's comfortable enough to say i'm gonna cover the mortgage and all the other stuff you can handle the light bill baby you can take me to dinner and every now and then mm-hmm. that is fine yeah that's fine mm-hmm. are you serious <laughs> yeah tyler perry Tyler Perry, Perry, good luck trying to sell that to your audience. What's okay. going on? If that's it. Then we can talk yeah. there. Okay. No, I wanted to see what he was going to say. Oh, okay. okay. So, yeah. So, that's basically what he said. He basically was saying what you just heard. I agree. That's better than me. Um, I agree with than you. me saying. I don't know so why let's people get riled up about this. Let's break it down. And they like don't have people. to. Op- Here's the thing. Why do we get so riled up about someone's opinion? If we don't agree with it or right. have to do it and walk in that opinion, why are we getting mad at him for how he feels? Right. So he says a lot of women, oh, especially black women. Now, I'm breaking it down while everybody's mad. Go ahead. So first they got mad because he said a lot of women. And then he said, especially mm-hmm. black women. Because we're vocal about it. Well, I'm letting you know why he Ebony keep a man. made that okay. clear. We're both. So go. he's saying the reason why women are mad, a lot of black women are mad, is because they felt like he didn't have to single us out. He could have just said a lot of women. He didn't have to say especially black women. Okay. And I met I might get in trouble for saying this. So he knew he was gonna get backlash oh, okay, for saying okay. this. Okay, so he knew it was coming. He said, but I'll begin. In our society right now. Black women are making a lot more money, for the most part, than black men. 
So I feel like he said, especially black women, because most white women don't make more money than white men. But in our community, most black women make We're more money than black men. Income right. now, taking his so I think that's why he said, especially black women. Okay. White women don't normally find themselves in this situation mm -hmm. because white women generally don't make more than white men. Right. Even the most successful white women. Or the men that they do end up with, whether right. he's white or any other color. Right. Right. Go ahead. Okay. And it's usually they make more money than them. Mm -hmm. So that's why he's saying this. But because our man is being put in prison or all kind of stuff, mm -hmm. it's not unlock. It's not, it doesn't, it makes sense to say the people out there making most money in our community is women, black women. Okay. For the most part. So then he said, Perry continued. If you can find love, if that man works at whatever job and is a good man, and is good to you and honors you and honors the house and honors his wife and does what he can because his gift might not be your gift. That is okay. Now, some women ran with, I don't want no man who ain't, who broke and don't have no job. He didn't say that. He didn't say he that. He said, if that man works yes. at whatever he job does. that he does. Whether it's white collar or so black it's not, he's not. Right there, he distinguishes. He has a job. He's distinguishing just some man that's sitting home on the couch. He's not a scrub. Watching television and playing video games on that. I no scrub. Okay. Okay. So he has a job. Thank and you. whatever that's, that is. That's checkpoint. Okay. okay. That's number two. He's a good man. Mm -hmm. He's good to you. Oh, that's a big one. Because even with money, top CEO. May not be a good man. May not be good to may you. May not treat you right. And you be back tan all now, the time. He says he honors you. He honors the house. Thank you. Thank you. He honors his wife. That's and does what he can. Because his gift yes. might not be, be your, your gift. gift. And that's okay. That's okay. That's not that's not somebody that's beneath you. Yes. Because remember, he's honoring you. That's too. somebody who came to love you at your work. Yes. Now we gotta get away from thinking. A bus driver, a garbage guy that collects garbage, a landscaper, um, anybody. We got to get away from this. If somebody makes less money than me, yes. then they're beneath me. They're beneath me. Money does not mean that you are above anybody else. Thank you. The person who you are. Makes you above other people. That like if somebody's a scum bucket, uh, I'm going to say he's beneath me. I'm better than that. That's what I would say. That's my character. My character is better than that. Because we know money magnifies you. But money it's, does not make somebody above somebody mm -hmm. or beneath somebody as far as or their, over as anybody. Far as their character and their integrity. Because one thing we do learn, and we see this in, in every lifestyle, every job, every career. Yes. If you are a butthole yes. with no money. You'll be a bigger butthole with money. With money. If you are a numbskull, a moron like Trump, you're going to be a moron as a billionaire. A billionaire moron. And your billionaire wife, Melania, will be on the other side of the mansion crying in her pillow at night yes. with her Chanel bag. Yes. Who wants him? Because he's a billionaire. But why are they jumping down his throat for this comment? Well, let's keep going. The Medea actor continued. Now. That shade right there. Why you keep calling him the Medea actor? Because Tyler Perry is more than Medea. The sad thing about it is that we can't say that anymore. At his beginning, he owns a year, studio. He's, oh, how many black men or women own a studio? All right. So the Medea actor. So they decreased him down to the Medea actor. Thank you. Continue. Thank you. Go ahead. As long as he's securing himself to know that, yeah. She makes most of the money. Yeah. Okay. Stop right there. They went off on him by saying most guys who don't make more money than their women, they are jealous or they are insecure. There's a lot of guys who are. I agree with that. But Not why, most. But, why? but he didn't say that. 
He said, as long as he's secure in himself. He had to make that clear. To know that, yeah, my, she makes more money than me. It's like they didn't hear anything he said. That's what I'm trying to that figure out. That took off the men who are insecure and jealous of you making more money than him. And the sad thing about it, <clears throat> when I saw this article you wanted to talk to about to on the show tonight, I didn't even hear what he said. Right, okay. I just guessed. And I asked my sister, why are people coming down Right, well, let's keep going. Go ahead. And he says, all I can pay is the light bill. So they got mad at that. So he works a job. He has money. and all. He doesn't have money, but he has a job. And all you can afford is the light bill. In my opinion, if you making that much money as the woman and you rich or whatever, your light bill might be about $2,000 a month. Thank that you. might be all he can pay is the light bill. If he's a regular job guy. Thank you. We're who has over $2,000 a month to pay on a light bill? We're talking about a utility bill in a home that's probably a nice size home. And he says he can pay the light bill. In other words, you he probably don't even need to pay that because you make so much money. But he feel like, well, at least let me pay that so I can say, yeah. hey, hey, I'm keeping the lights on for us, honey. Yeah, I'm contributing. <sighs> Keep going. As long as she's comfortable enough to say, I'm going to cover the mortgage and all the other stuff, mm -hmm. that's fine. He prefaced it by saying, as long as she's comfortable. Now, let's look at what we talked about a few weeks ago. Gabrielle Union and um, um, Dwayne Wade. Uh -huh. I didn't agree with her paying half. Because she said she stays up at night worrying about being poor, about being poor <laughs> and about not working and making bills. Right. When your husband is over a hundred million dollars, it'd be different if she never complained about that. He said she's comfortable. Mm -hmm. This is what Tyler Perry. In other words, mm -hmm. you married me. In other words, she could probably live by herself and pay all her bills, mm -hmm. and she's fine. Yeah, yeah. You are adding on to her life in other ways that's not financial. Yes. So if she's comfortable. Now, if because this was one of the things that some of the women was mad about. What? With, I'm tired. I have to get up. I have to work. I want somebody that's in there like me. He didn't say you. He didn't say your type of job. You're obviously in a whole nother level than what he's talking about. Thank Tyler you. Perry is a billionaire. Thank you. A lot of y'all women got mad and y'all not don't even make over. Some of y'all make maybe $100,000 a year. This level. A little bit over 100000 You darn sure ain't making $400,000 a year. Yes. He ain't talking about you. Because you poor. You got one foot in the grave. Uh, not the grave. One foot at your job and one foot in the uh, poor house. If you lose your job, you are not a billionaire like Tyler Perry. Right. So he's not talking about you. I think he's talking about people like Oprah, who's with Stedman. Yes. I guarantee you he's talking about Oprah with Stedman. Yes. Because that's his friend. And he sees how the dynamic of that duo that works. Relationship. And he sees that Stedman is secure. Yes. And that she's secure. Thank you. And she's a billionaire. But you know what? They'll she don't have one. You got to they get up and get both but work. They, <gasps> but they would do. They may not see it that way. And even in that situation. Because they'll see like what Ebony says. Oprah Stedman is not a bus driver. No, he's not a blue collar worker. We know he's a speak. He speaks. He gets paid for his yes. speaking. He writes. He was making author. over a two, so he does thousand when he, he met does Oprah. well. And I see sometimes women are like, "I'm okay with me making more than him." If he's, it's kind of like we always see people's levels of money. Like you even call out DDG, right? And and Hallie, people keep saying that DDG he is more, she make more than him. He's using he's her for money, he's and that he got her pregnant for money. And I'm sitting here going, "You morons! I watch YouTube. I'm on YouTube. He makes more money than her. Yeah. Actors do not make that much money. Y'all need to get away from that. Neither do musicians." A lot of these people that y'all think are living high and making a lot of money, they don't have a lot of money. A lot of these YouTubers make a million dollars a month. I'm trying to wrap my head. A month. I'm trying to wrap my head around social media influencers making millions of dollars. But my thing is to add to this, why are we 
I think we've gotten in, in our minds in this world when we're with somebody or getting with somebody, we think of the the the, the material things. Yes. Everything is material. Yes. He he even said the checklist. He preferences. They're it. adding to your life. They're quitting. Treating good you man, like a good queen. person, loves they you, take honors care you. Of you. If somebody was to get in your face, they would make sure he would not right. get in your face. Right. But then they, they'll take it and go rub your feet. No, no. Then they'll take it and say the reason why they mad. Because look at Nicki Minaj with her husband. He's a doofus. Oh. He didn't say a nut, a, a guy that goes out at four o'clock in the morning, yeah. standing in front of a five star hotel, saying, "I'm on the street. I'm on the street." <laughs> Yeah, come on, Offset. I'm on the string. Okay. I'm on, and they said that's why you don't marry believe you. No, he didn't say marry a nut job. Nut job right, with no integrity. He said somebody that's good for you and who honors you. Nicki Minaj's husband in the front of a five star hotel talking about come on drive by Offset is not honoring her. I don't want. He's a nutty nut job. I don't want Tyler Perry. To apologize. Yeah, he better not. Please don't. Because everything he said, he was real clear. When he talked about the integrity of the man. Right. That's making less. Right. He talked about that man's um, up secureness. Watch. Now look at this. Go ahead. Now some social media users, this is the women that decided that they wanted to go all off on this, um, argued, and that's probably why they single, that if a man can only afford to pay a bill here and there, maybe he's not ready to be in a serious relationship. No. I said, if you really about that life and you making that money, you probably live in a house he probably wouldn't have lived in. If he's just a regular working guy, he probably would have got a regular middle class house. You want to live with the Joneses and yeah. not in the, on the, in the, the suburb of Atlanta right. where you got a million, two million dollar house. Well, then now your life bill is more than what this dude making. <laughs> so he, you for, you forced him to that's like uh, it's like Stedman. Stedman was over working, making over two, three hundred thousand dollars a year. You moving with Oprah, who's a billionaire. Thank you. And a bi I remember when they lived in Chicago, she was on the top of the John yes, Hancock building. Yes. Stedman's $200,000 a year job could not afford him living on the top of the, the, the John Hancock or building. property in Maui. No. A whole almost island. city island in Maui. But she living good and they do And he's well. living with her. For what we know. They're now, why, well. why is he a low life? Because he can't afford to pay her $200,000 oh, life bill they, every month. They put him in a category because he's not a low life, blue collar bus driving like Ebony said. Oh, <laughs> so it depends on the job then. Yes. He's okay. not taking the trash. He's so, not driving the trash. So book. I dismissed that little statement right there. If all he can afford is pay a light bill here and there, here and there he's not ready for a serious relationship or a family. Mm -hmm. Not true. Mm -hmm. um, also, some also argue that instead of telling women to lower their standards, Perry should encourage men to rise to the occasion. Not true either. Let me tell you why. First of all, why is it again that because somebody makes less money than you, that is lowering your standard? Thank what kind you. of standard? What is your standard? What is your standard based on? Money? Yeah. I Obviously, your standard is money. If you're saying, Tyler's saying, Lord, your standard. I'm going back to material things. It's materialistic. Yes. So he's not telling you to lower your standard. He didn't say marry uh, Nicki Minaj's husband. Who has money. Who, right? that, to me, that's, no, that's lowering your standard. But he has money. No, he just got out of jail. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's lowering your standard. Well. He didn't say that. He said, good to you, honors you, honors the family. Is a good man. But we know, too, from uh, personal experience that ex-convicts, or we don't say it anymore. Will we say the word now? Being politically oh, correct. Uh, I don't know. We've known people who have gotten out of prison, mm -hmm. out of jail, and they're doing well. They've gotten a business. They started mentoring men who even go, or women who go to prison. They are doing something. You can tell when you meet somebody that they are a person of integrity. Right. They have a good heart. Yeah. You don't you can't tell there's how no a person's dollar gonna sign treat on you that. on his income. And there's no dollar sign on that. God, why we got why we do this as women, and not says, just black women, I get it. Right. Women in general. Women, but he says, I know people this is what Perry said, I know people whose men 
can't touch what they make. Right. Which we already know he's talking about, like Oprah. But when you see them together, yes, that love, that support that I got you, babe, is a beautiful thing. Uh-huh. Remind y'all, Tina Turner married her driver. Yes. Thank you. Is that beneath her? That man treated her good. He loved her until she died. Thank you. He was her driver. Her driver. Tina Turner. Oh, gosh. Now, one cop commenter said, while there's nothing wrong with dating a man who earns less, men often can't handle when a woman earns more. He already settled that. Thank you. He said he's comfortable. Yes, this man is a comfortable man. He's He's secure. He's giving you guys the man. You guys are adding on to what he's saying. Yeah, or taking away. He didn't say a guy who's sitting at home uh, hating every time you walk out the door. Thank you. Because you make more money. He already gave you the the drop the checklist of what this man is already. What if he's a teacher? Teachers don't make nothing. They sure don't. What if he's a teacher? What if he likes being a teacher? And let's go there for a moment. I love teachers. I love men that are teachers. What if he's a teacher and, and he, he like and he don't want to be he don't want to go to a, a university. He likes teaching fifth graders in the hood. Thank you. Urban. What if he if he's a black man, he likes teaching high school in the Robert Taylor home. And you just happen to be what six three three six six figures. And you live in Chicago. Let's do Chicago because we are we here. Right. And you make over two hundred thousand dollars, three hundred thousand mm-hmm. dollars a year. In your job. And you have an a a condo downtown Chicago mm-hmm. off Michigan Avenue or mm-hmm. something. And you meet this guy and he's a teacher. Thank you. At Robert Taylor Homes or whatever, Cabrini Green. In the in the projects. And area. you met him, you maybe you're in a sorority or something. He's mm-hmm. in a fraternity or something. Yeah. And you like him. Yeah. You're not gonna marry him because he's a teacher and oh, he makes thirty thousand dollars a year. He's beneath me. And what if he don't want? Like he said, Tyler said, his gifts aren't your gifts. Thank his you. talents aren't your talents. Thank what if you. he doesn't want to be a make three hundred thousand dollars a year? He wants to impart in kids. He's even getting. He, he's even a part of organizations that impart in children, building them up, making them feel good about themselves. Yeah. That's important to me. Yeah. Than the fact that he's beneath me with his income. Really? And then it says, Perry is giving advice as potentially single man, man since he is uh, has his last public relationship was with model and filmmaker, whatever. The two started dating and they going through this whole thing. So the bottom line is... I didn't like that when people came at him with his comment. I they really, really went off on what he said. Disappointed. They didn't address what he actually said. They added on to they it. They added. They said, oh, I don't want nobody that's a bum. I don't want nobody that just sits at home. I don't want nobody... He said he has a job. I don't want nobody who's jealous of me. He just said he's confident. Com- confident. He's I don't want nobody man. that I got to work. I got to work in order for us to still live at the top of that mansion. I want somebody to add on. He didn't say, he said, she's comfortable. Yeah. Everything that y'all going after him with, he, he already he addressed it. Yes. He said, she's comfortable. Now, where I will agree with y'all, if you, if you want to stay at the top of the high rise on top of the, um, El Michigan the Avenue, penthouse, the penthouse. you're not going to marry a teacher because it's going to be all on you to stay up there. I agree then. But you know what we were talking about? Because then you're not going to be comfortable. But we, I want somebody that's going to add to this. But here's the thing, too. I was telling my <laughs> sister, a lot of these women who are probably complaining at the comments he's making and not really hearing with their ears and their heart. We 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 used to um we would say that some women are like cars. Mm-hmm. We would put them in categories. Oh, yeah. There's no women, men put women men in categories. Men do too. I'm just saying this for us how we would play with it. There are BMW women. There are women that are BMWs. Mm-hmm. They are sports cars. They are like whoa Maserati. Men put women uh, in categories. Uh, uh, Rolls some men, Royce. Some men. So you know she got it going on. Exactly. And then there's a Ford Taurus. Right. A Kia Soul. Yes. A van. Yes. A, a, all the little cars go in the categories. Yes. Even the little tiny Pinto. Yes. If you are not a BMW. BMW. What are you, you screaming? Thank I don't want BMW. Don't man. We ain't making no exactly. money. In, in, in. But you I'm, know what? A lot of women who are what men would call that category. What? They don't make a lot of money. 
They don't have to because they know they're going to find somebody that's a basketball player or a football oh, player. See. Why am I killing myself to make they'll a lot just, of money when I don't have to? They'll just be cute at the, at the just be cute. and the football player comes It's over. always the ones that's not the BMW <laughs> that's making all of the problems. That's true. Because she got to get out there and hustle. I got to hustle. Give me a man. Where the man at? She can't Ooh, walk. You don't make that much. She can't walk into a club and all the basketball players look at her. Mm-hmm. I'm not in that circle, right? Even though and, you got the butt, but but you want a guy like that. And here's the other thing, and I hate the, and I guess this is where women hated Kevin Samuels, the one that passed oh, away. Yeah, and I guess yeah. I'm kind of like that in a sense. I don't like everything that he said, yeah. but y'all would hate me if y'all really you listen to the eat stuff. The meat and spit the bones out with him. I'm similar to him. If me, what do I look like going in? I'm using me as an example. I know. Why would I go in saying this? I did it, 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 it. and you my list is this. Me. You ain't making more than me. This my list. You should be happy you got somebody. But I think too. <laughs> let's go back to even like the, the. But I am, I am a hypocrite though. I know you are. I'm thinking about <laughs> if she got her nerve, but we can go there because y'all see. Our I've old said shows. it in other stuff, yeah. but I don't want a fat man. Let's go. That's back. a hypocrite. I know. Let's go back mm-hmm. to the comment that Ebony uh-huh. made. Right. Now, Ebony, we all know she's a news person. She's in the TV. She's not whatever. a BMW, she's, though. She's old. No, that doesn't mean anything. Age doesn't no, no, mean anything. No, no, we were saying BMW. But, but, go ahead. but men can still see them as, oh, she's a nice little. But they could get a 20 year old beverage. Are we not? Uh, whatever. Her you name and is. I keep talking about that. I'm not talking about what they could have, would have, should have. Let's put her in the category of what she is. All right. She's an attractive woman. She right. is. And she's making big money. Right. When she made that comment about, I don't want no bus driver. Right. I don't want no bus. And then she was with Ayana Van Zandt. Mm-hmm. And of course, Ayana, she she challenged her right, too. Right. She didn't come quite like Tyler did. Right. But I Tyler think she was, was nice. She was hinting along. I think she was going down the same road that Tyler As was. As Tyler was saying. You yeah. want a man with character, a man with integrity, a man with a goal, with a purpose. Our He's, country is And a horrible. teacher. If Ebony got with a teacher, a school teacher in South Side of Chicago, Really, Ebony? That's another thing, too. We He's only end making, what, 40000 right. 50000 You making six figures? Right. We'll you wouldn't it. talk to this teacher? We'll end it with this. Go ahead. A lot of times, we got to remember, too. I'm getting all hot and whatever. Okay. These women don't know what they're talking about. A lot of them do well, all that talking. A lot of them are still single. No, no. A lot of them do all that talking. And the, the a fine dude or something come along and whistle at them or something. They'll be, you'll be moving in their penthouse in a And he don't have no job. He don't have no job or nothing. He dealing and willing on the street. They'll fix him up and they don't tell nobody that you don't do nothing. Just when they ask you what you do, you look do, good. Just, you're like, I can't. Yeah, just say that to you, you know. Or they meet somebody, he's funny. So fix. we a lot of talk. Yeah, talk. You go to a comedy club and some old broke comedian is up on stage because I'm a comedian. They don't make no money. <laughs> they do. Everybody not Kevin Hart. These guys are broke. Thank you, they are. And they get up there and they tell jokes and all this, and then he talking to you after the and club. And they live in the basement of their mom's home. <laughs> he going from hotel to hotel doing gigs. Oh and then he God. talk to you after the show, and you giggling and ha ha and hoo hooing, mm-hmm. and you make over two hundred, three hundred thousand dollars a year, and you an old broke comedian because he look good. Or because you seen them on television. Oh, I saw him on Comic uh, Comic Jam. So you thinking a lot of this is Comic Jam. Talk. He ain't worth nothing. I just really feel bad for Tyler that he's gotten slammed for that comment. Tyler don't care. He's a billionaire. Thank you, Tyler Perry. Regardless yes. of them with calling you whatever name to whoever, yes. you're not the right person to say this comment. Yes. You can. You're a billionaire. Say, and he's single. But you made it very clear. How the purse, that man, he needs to be this way. Exactly. And you need to he be left, okay. He left no stone unturned. No, he, he didn't. He made sure that he said he had a job. He was a good He's man. Secure. He, and you're comfortable. I agree. Now, this is the part it where. has to be both This ways. is the part where yes. I agree with some of what the women are saying. That's mad. If I'm not comfortable, then don't do it. Then you shouldn't be with That's it. That's right. If I'm not comfortable, if I feel like I got to get up every morning. And I have to work in order for us to live and and be have all of this. Mm-hmm. I'm not comfortable with that. Mm-hmm. Then I agree. You shouldn't marry a school teacher or somebody. Mm-hmm. You need to marry somebody that got just as much money or more money than you. Mm-hmm. Because you want to live that lifestyle. Right. And he ain't going to help you. Mm-hmm. He's barely paying the light bill. Right. So if you want that, 
but, then you don't need to marry that guy. And, and you're still going back to materialistic. But that, that's how they are, then that's fine. Then that's going to kill Men you. are materialistic. They want to marry a good, beautiful woman. Being material over yeah. relationship that's fine. building and, pers- and, and Look, building the character and the relationship. I don't say nothing to people that do that. It's not going to last. It might. It's not going to last. It might. Because you're basket, not going to always have your materials. But some basket, Your materials get blown away by right. a tornado. Some basketball players want to marry somebody that good, look good. And they did. And they've been married for about 40, 50 years. Yeah. So it doesn't and matter. I, and my head goes off to them. Yeah. But they, who's to say that they both wore material? She probably was like, I love him. I'm going to stay with him. I'm going to keep him. He may have cheated on me right. or whatever. They wanted to but both decided to keep the marriage. Too. I know. So That's it don't matter. Saying. So we just really need to get off this material thing, being but number one. But if you are, I'm fine with it. I'm saying if that's what you are, well, that's what I'm then saying. that's what you are. If you are that, you will not, of course, agree with him. But exactly. you don't have to agree with him. And this is, exactly. this is his opinion. That's what I'm He's talking to people that are yes. not materialistic. Right. He's not talking to you if your standard is money. Exactly. If your standard is good, the most beautiful woman in the room, a man, then that's not you don't the message to agree from with you. him. There you go. Yeah. It's like the scrub song. Yeah, if you're not a scrub, it don't, it don't hit you. you that message ain't, ain't talking to me. She ain't talking to me. Right. Okay, go ahead. But that's what I'm saying. If you are, that's fine. Okay. Um, but apparently it's not because they slamming them. That's what I'm saying. I'm saying a lot of the women that slamming him, they don't fit in that description. They just stupid. <laughs> um, Cotillia says, hi, ladies and mama. Wendy says, hello, girls. Um, Emerald says, hey, ladies. Hey, everybody. Um, everybody saying hi to each other. Justice for All says, where are these men hiding? Um, yeah, no, teachers, teachers and things like that. Um, William says, hi, Emerald. He's saying hi to everybody. And Emerald said, William, you where are these it. men hiding? Ah. And also, too, I don't have a problem with people having a long list. Be okay if you don't get it. Yeah. If you're okay and you're secure and say, I could die single, mm-hmm. I'm fine. Yeah. Then I mean, I'm not, okay with I that. And I get everything on my list. Yeah. I may only get a few of my 10. Yeah. And if there's some things you don't want to bend on, that's fine. Mm-hmm. But understand that that pool is small mm-hmm. and you may not. And then y'all be praying to God. He's not mm-hmm. going to listen to your prayer. As you get older, <laughs> that list gets a little shorter. You hear what I said? He's not going to listen. You know what? If you're, if you're, God praying, is not going to listen. Let me to tell you, you why. You are only bent on material. That's what I was If your prayer is God, the standard is money. Your prayer is bouncing God off the said, ceiling. I want you and him to be together. God says, render unto Caesar what is his and unto God what is his. Thank if you. I have somebody for you, I, he don't come with no price tag mm-hmm. and a gold bowl written on him saying he's worth this. Thank he's you. worth more because he's saved and he's going to heaven. Oh, he's a man that loves God. I don't put my work, my work on people. That's God saying on humans. Thank you. On how much money they got. Right. If you had all the riches in the world, you wouldn't have what I have. Thank you. So don't pray to God for that. Yeah. That's bouncing off the roof. <laughs> but if you're praying for Him for self, Him to be saved, things that's genuine, things yeah. that God would even say, yeah. I don't want somebody that has a quick, a uh, quick anger, God. Yeah. Okay, I got it. Mm-hmm. I don't want somebody that don't know you, God. Okay. I want them to kind of have the same religion I got. Okay. Yeah, same faith. Where yeah. We are. I, I go to church. Okay. All right. Each other Even else. Yeah. God, I don't want anybody that's that's um, that's yeah. not healthy, that yeah. don't run. I exercise every day. Yeah. Kind of listen to that because that's healthy. Yeah. Why am I sending you a smoker or something and you I don't, don't smoke? I don't know. But money, your prayers bouncing off the ceiling. <laughs> And you may have to maybe seek going outside your race. Yeah. Do I that. like dark men, so I can't go outside. No, I don't. We talked about that preference thing. You can have a preference for right. a certain color look and hair color. You may not get that preference, That's true. though. I like dark men. I have men. too many friends who had preferences for certain men, and they, the guy I meet go, Oh, he's I, totally I opposite like, to what you've been like in college. I like dark men. I married a light skinned man. Yeah, see, so that's that. It doesn't matter okay. what your preference is. That's true. All right, look at him. Look at the little man. Let's move us over here. Yeah, you said this story today. Yes, it's a sad story. A two-